everyone and welcome back to another video. Today's video, I'm going to talk about the things I don't do to my hair that you guys may think I do to my hair because my videos are really based on questions and my own experience as far as my hair care routines, things of this sort, okay? Skincare as well. Um, you guys already know my skincare is very, very basic. I just have two steps. That's cleanser and then moisturizer, and that's it, a.m. and p.m., okay? So that's why you don't see too many skincares, but that's that's all I do to my skin. I wear bare I wear bare skin. I don't wear foundation or anything of that sort. Someone was asking me that, what kind of foundation or, or BB cream are you using? Thank you guys so much. I, I try to keep up with my skin. I truly do. Um, but yeah, so um, I'm just going to go to right with the video. Today is Monday. You guys will see this video on Tuesday. I promise on Tuesday because I'm not going to do any editing today. I'm going to get back, back downstairs and I'm going to finish cooking, but you'll see it Tuesday once I come home. Okay. Um, yeah. So the first thing, um, the number one, number one would be, um, are you taking any um, supplements or hair hair vitamins? Now, I've been asked that a lot. Um, I truly believe if I was taking hair vitamins, my hair would be longer than what it is right now. But everything that I'm doing in my hair care, I just really depend on the food groups that I that I eat, that I um, that I do eat and cook. Um, that is my fruits, vegetables. I try to eat right because I still love to snack on sweet things and candy and things of that sort. I still like to snack on those. I don't eat them all the time throughout the day, every day. That's something I don't do, but I still like to eat um, snacks. Sometimes I like to splurge, like get a burger or fish sandwich, things of that sort, but it's always best to cook your own meals and try to cook them healthy, okay? But I just depend on that. So I've never taken any hair care vitamins before. Um, MSM, someone was asking me about MSM. I didn't know what that was till I looked it up. So no, I don't take any form or any brand of hair um, vitamins or supplements to grow out my hair, all right? Number two, um, are you copying somebody's regimen um, to get your hair to grow? Um, no, I'm not copying anybody's hair care regimen. Um, I came up with my own hair care regimen. Um, the only one that I did take that copy off of was my grandson, Michael, with the Shea Moisture, him. And then on YouTube, Samantha Erica, she was using the raw shea butter, um, uh, I believe the, the deep treatment mask and also the shampoo. But I got the, the shampoo, the conditioner and the deep treatment mask. That's what I'm using from Shea Moistures. So I, I love those products and they work very well in my hair. Um, so no, I'm not copying off of anyone's hair care regimen, just figuring out some things um, for my hair. And what I have noticed, my hair is changing along with my skin and also my, my organs. You know, we are, if you're still living and you're not 20 years old and you're 40, 50, 60, you know, there are some things you just can't do when you were 20 or eat. I know certain things that I eat sometimes it don't agree with me and I know if I eat anything after six o'clock if it's like a meal something not real heavy but I notice it bothers me a little bit so I have to watch it so I don't eat anything after six o'clock if I do get a little hungry I might chew on some grapes or something like that watermelon because we keep watermelon in the house I might chew on something like that not that things like this, like fruits, vegetables, you know, that stuff don't bother me. But if I eat like, a, go make me a sandwich, you know, and then drink some juice or water, something like that, maybe an hour later, it's messing with my stomach. So I have to be careful. And I'm just getting up in age as well. So yeah, and I noticed my hair is changing too. The silver part of my hair is a little more coarser and thicker than the hair that's not, and it's relaxed. So it acts like this when my hair is relaxed as well. So just really just paying attention to my hair, how it reacts to certain products, how it doesn't act to certain products, you know, how it feels, how it looks. All of this, this is really taking care of your hair and just having a good regimen that really works for you. And a lot of us are low porosity on YouTube, I noticed that, and a few high porosity hairs. 
Um, the products that they use may not work for me. The products that I use may not work for them. But even with that being said, we're all doing the same thing. We're just trying to maintain a healthy scalp. And I know I know, I am. So, yeah. Another one that has been asked of me is, have I set any hair care goals? I see a lot of women setting hair care goals on their channels. That's something that I don't do and I'm really not interested in. I am just really trying to maintain a healthy scalp and um, healthy hair and my hair will grow as long as it will get so I'm not saying that by December 2019 my hair is going to be 20 inches that's something I'm not doing because things happen you know what I mean and your hair is not growing as it used to when you was a teeny bop or you're 20 years old and I'm 58 my hair is not growing at a faster rate than it was when I was in my 20s and my 30s so no, I'm not setting any goals. I think that'll be kind of silly of me to be doing something like that, you know. And I have seen women my age with longer hair, but I'm not setting any goals for my hair. I'm just trying to maintain a healthy uh, scalp and hair. So that's basically that's basically it. Um, someone else was asking me, do I uh, flat iron my hair or, or blow dry my hair in order for it to look lengthy or longer? No, I do not. That's kind of ridiculous because that's adding heat to my hair. And if I was doing something like that, that, my hair would break off, dry up and break off. So that's something I'm not doing. Okay. Um, I'm just, I'm just taking care of my hair. So if my hair looks longer, that's because it's growing. Okay. It's not that I'm flat out in my hair or, or blow drying. I do air dry. If you've been with me for a while, then you know, I'm, 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 I'm not using any blow dryers and I'm not flat out in my hair. I know a lot of women get on here, flat out the hair or blow dry the hair and then flat iron the hair, things of that sort. They're doing this every week. I cut that out. I cut that out two years ago. So it'll be three years next year in the summer, I believe. Okay, so yeah. So these are the things that was asked that people think that I'm doing to my hair that I'm not doing in order to grow my hair. And this one is a kicker. Are you using hair products that say grow or growth or growing? You know, things of that sort. Um, some of my packaging may say grow, but I'm not out there to just target um, products that says grow or growing or growth. Um, I'll show you what I'm going to be using. Um, I'll show you what I'm going to be using for the fall and winter. I'll get that video up week after next because I do have another one coming up this Friday that you guys will see. Okay, but this one you will see Tuesday. All right, sometime in the, in the evening you'll see Tuesday. But um, I don't, I don't, I don't buy products that say grow, growing. You have to be careful with that. Even though they say that, you know, ten out of ten, it may not be true. Now there are some out there that that really um, does what it say. It does what it say. But just because something say grow or growing, you know, things of that, you know, you don't have to buy that because you, it may not happen. And then that's another fail, okay, and another disappointment. You know what I'm saying? And another setback. So you don't want to do things of that sort. Okay, so yeah, so that's basically it. Those are were the main questions that were asked of me. Let me know in the comments down below what people think you're doing that you're not to your hair in order for your hair to grow. Okay, thank you guys so much. Have a wonderful week and the weekend to come. And if it's the Lord's will, you will see the next video Saturday. All right, thank you guys. God bless you. Bye-bye. Thank you.